Hey guys, how's it going? It's just gonna be a real quick video today. I wanted to show you uh, something I've been using to make Instagram ads. So uh, Instagram stories that is allow you to put these videos on there, but they have to be this weird size. And uh, yeah, so for me, figuring out how to do this without using some crazy complex tools was pretty important because I want to make a bunch of them to test for my new copywriting guide. So here's the first one I made. It's pretty straightforward, pretty simple, but uh, I'll show you how to do this real quick with Keynote. So you probably do the equivalent with PowerPoint, but I'm going to show you in Keynote because they made it super easy to do this. Uh, first off, we're just going to make a new presentation. Uh, we do a white black, doesn't really matter. And then we want to go into our document settings in the top right here. And we want to change our screen size to the size that Instagram likes, which is the opposite of 1080p. Well, the it's the same, but vertical, I guess. So our width is going to be 1080, and our height is going to be 1920. So that is the height and width of our Instagram story. Now, I like using um, Keynote because uh, just straightforward, really easy point and click stuff. Uh, settings so you can use obviously more complex software but this is just for us run and gun folks who like to make quick ads so I'll show you a real simple one that I made here I'm just gonna literally just copy this over into this setting here and kind of show you how we have it set up now this is a video so I got this video off a of stock website um, I'll put a link to some different ones in the description. You can obviously use your own uh, videos, but I really, I'm, I'm a big fan of the old story blocks. So let's just say we want to get a different picture. Let's just say guy on a street. I spelled street wrong. Just so we can mix this up. And sure, why not? Eh, meh. Let's get something a little more interesting. Ooh, what's this dude doing? He's just he's just walking. Now the the headline for this ad itself is the first rule of copywriting is get attention. So I do want him looking at the screen. Just a small tip. I mean, you know, since <laughs> that's the headline. Except guys, I guess are too cool to look at the screen. What about this dude? You gonna look at the screen? Nope. Nope. All right, you're looking at the screen, fine. I'll go with you. All right, so I usually just get the HD version because it's all gonna be compressed down anyways. I can download here. I'm gonna download it into my advertising and just make a new little folder called video graphics, young man, beard, blah, 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 blah. Then there's a few things we wanna do here in Keynote to make this work perfectly so with the new keynote I have the latest one I'm not sure uh, you know if this works with all ver versions but uh, we can just drop in videos so I'll just kind of show you this process here pull this headline out all this good stuff move aside for now then we want to just click our little media button up here at the top choose we go to video graphics pick our little dude here and drop it in It'll import it, do its thing. Now there's a couple different things we can do here. Since this is a 1080p wide, we can actually go up to the uh, 1920 width without losing any resolution. So I'm gonna bring it to about, to about to here. You can see the width and the height changing as I drag it. The native resolution is 1920 by 1080. So we'll get about eh, there. And then center him up. Pull our headline in here and now right click on the video, send it back. We're gonna do a few things to the video itself. And we can drop this on here. Forgot our little copy tip link here, call to action. We actually should probably put a like legit call to action in here. So let's grab this and just say, for more tips, visit kind of a weak call to action, but whatever. We're just making a video here. All right, so next, there's a few things we wanna do here to make this 
awesome. Um, we can actually in the top right here go in and change up the format of this vid uh, video here. We can do a couple different things. We can add some drop shadows, some reflections. I really like the reflection look. Do all kinds of fun stuff, but I'm gonna go ahead and just put the drop shadow in or uh, reflection. It's kind of a nice look when it's live. Then also we want to click on the video again, go up the top right here, hit movie. And we want to change just a few steps here. Let's just have it loop back and forth so that it will play forward and then backwards. So it's not just like a hard loop, which is kind of cool. And then I'm going to turn off this start movie on click because we're just going to use this one thing. Now I've never really, we can trim it down if we want. We can do a little bit there, but. All right, now to get this video actually exported out for Instagram, there's a couple different ways to do it, but the easiest way is to go up to our Keynote File Export to Movie setting here. And then there's a few things we'll want to do. We're going to change this to self plane so that we don't have to actually do anything with it. And then we're just going to have it do 10 seconds here. And since it's just one slide, we're going to make that zero. Then this is important. We want to change the custom settings here to the resolution of our keynote, which is uh, 1080 by 1920. Make sure that it's 1080 by 1920. Now you can do these crazy high resolution, but you definitely don't need to. Uh, the H.264 codec is just fine for Instagram. Then you'll hit next and it'll do its thing. You'll select where you want it and press export. Now I've already exported this. It took actually a pretty decent amount of time. Um, it took this, this <laughs> Mac has an i9 in it, super high end processor, plenty of RAM still took for this 20 second clip, uh, about five to 10 minutes. Nah, it's under 10 minutes, but anyways, expect it to be a while is the point. Um, and then you should get a file like this. If we press play, you'll see, oh, uh, that it's all here. Now I pop this on your phone. You can upload it to Instagram stories straight from there, or you can upload it via Facebook ads manager, all that good stuff. But yeah, that is a quick and easy way to make a Instagram story video, uh, either ad or just for your story with a video that you are using, uh, from either a stock photo or your phone. Uh, but nice thing is we can do it nice easily from a free program that comes with Mac OS X. Imagine PowerPoint as well, or even uh, Google uh, Drive uh, presentations can do this. But uh, yeah, quick tip of the day. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. We'll see you in the next one.